All right, good morning, everybody. It's Monday, and I am back at work here, and I am in the basement. And instead of putting a drywall ceiling in, my customers want to spray it black. So I just started a little bit right there, and I'll give you, um, I taped off all the lights, so I only have my one light with me, so you can't really see everything I have to paint, but it's a pretty big area down here. Two small rooms, I'm gonna spray it out. I'll give you an after shot when I'm done. All right, I just finished up spraying the ceiling. I'll show you some after shots. You can see some of the wet spot and some of the uh, dry spot. It's gonna dry, it's a flat, so it's a black flat. So it's gonna dry flatter. You can still see some of the wet spots. Uh, that only took about two and a half hours. <laughs> so I started first coat on these uh, walls and uh, you can see the seams, I'm brushing those all out just for the first coat. Um, I'm letting the up top dry so I could double cut that later and then roll out all these walls. It won't take too much. I was supposed to be outside today painting a uh, fence area, but all the rain we got, those the wood is soaking wet, so we're not gonna do that today. But at least I have something to do. I'm not gonna work a super long day. And uh, yeah, so that's about it. All right, that is gonna sum up my day. Um, the top part of the ceiling with the double coat in the basement was not dry enough to start cutting yet um, the body to the ceiling color because it was so dark and damp and cold in there. So that's all right. I was planning on leaving early anyway, so I got out early today. Um, my next open house for Clover is two weeks from yesterday. Um, not a lot going on. Not a lot of online leads coming through on this one. Even the online click-throughs and all the market report, it's just not a lot of, not a lot of movement. But that's all right. I think, um, I think we're gonna have to do a price drop within the next 10 days. Um, we're just not getting enough calls at all to uh, keep it at this price. So, I would like to drop it closer to 15000 and uh, do a lot of more advertising for the next open house. The last two open houses, we just didn't get enough advertising, um, especially the first one on the Sunday. Just two, we listed it like two days before the open and uh, in the Twilight Tour. Um, a lot, not a lot of people come to those anyways. I've done two or three and I probably got maybe one person. <laughs> per open so those aren't that exciting to me whatsoever um, and they always say that they're going to be excited because people would rather look at a couple houses in the evenings and people don't want to clog up their summer Sundays I get that but man I don't get a lot of people but that's alright we'll advertise the next one as much as we possibly can any extra advertising and social media and uh price drop about 15 so hopefully I'll get more some more people coming to it hopefully I can pick up a buyer that is absolutely my goal goal number one is to sell the house goal number two is get another transaction um, through this either another buyer or a seller or just something but we'll see that is gonna end my little thing for today um, this is the first time and I don't know when I'm actually leaving work at a really really reasonable time so the first time in uh, two or three weeks I'm gonna go for a bike ride so I'm psyched about that see you guys tomorrow something oddly satisfying about rolling out floors like this yesterday was the first coat and it dried really quick the second coat obviously is gonna sit on the top surface and take uh, three times as long to actually dry and up to two months to actually cure Oh, this is where I spent most of my week is in this basement. Spread out the ceiling, rolled in walls, cut all the trim, and now roll out the basement floor. Not a lot with real estate this week. I uh, met with my office manager yesterday, and he wants to meet to every every week to every two weeks and help grow my business. So the one thing we were talking about is uh, lead generation. And early on, I was kind of turned off to certain ways that he was suggesting just because I felt like you know, they were out of, out of date and out of style and 
excuse me, it's 2018, we should move on to different things. But he was talking about it yesterday, and I thought I decided to give everything that he was talking about a, a try. So with the next month, this will be in the end of June right now, so the next month I'm going to, uh, certain months, I'm going to do only certain lead generation things. And I think I'm going to try what he said first. Just pick a couple of roads, maybe do some mailings to them, which I'm kind of against mailings, but I'm going to try it. Who cares? Um, a couple mailings and maybe a couple of Popeyes. I'm going to give them my card or give them a, a just listed flyer or a postcard to uh, my listing on Clover, which is only a couple weeks old. And see how much that generates. If it generates a phone call or 10 phone calls or one listing, one buyer, and do do a couple of rows where I could do like 50 or 100 different homes. And keep track in a notebook and have a database filled out of how, what was my ratio of contact and move on. So then that would be like July. So then August, August, I will do something else that we're talking about only do those in August. Um, maybe a mix between expired and my own database or a mix between some online advertising or something like that. So we'll see how that all goes. Today is the end of my vlog. I know it wasn't a lot in this vlog, but that's all right. Um, a couple more weeks, there will be uh, much more exciting things. And I will vlog my mailings and my door-to-door -to, -door to see how those go and practice my one-on-one uh, -on -one talking to uh, clients. Anyways, that is it for today. Um, I only have a couple hours worth of work and then I'm out of here, so hopefully be out of here by Friday at noon, which is gonna be awesome. Haven't seen, haven't seen um, that time of day in a while. <laughs> um, if you like my videos, please like and subscribe and uh, see you next Friday.